no use. I can't shift it. John! How are we going to get out, John? It's all right. There's bound to be another way out somewhere. It's just a question of finding it, that's all. Are you all right? Yeah. Good. John? Yes? Do you really believe there's another way out? Well, we'll soon find out, won't we? Come on. Okay. We're supposed to wait here, Mr. Corby. He won't be long. Lovely country for walking, isn't it? Well, come on, let's go inside, shall we? You've been doing a lot of walking today. You're still a copperhead heart, aren't you, Tom? Still got that suspicious mind. Well, the big job, it's not here. We've still got a long way to go. So what your boy's seen doesn't matter. So far. Well, where have you been? I've just been checking up. But they're not bothering anyone, so I'm happy. First thing in the morning, we move off. They stay behind. So everything's all right. Well, come on. Let's eat. I'm hungry. Well, we'll have to try one of them. mark the rocks as we go along, and then we'll number the rocks so we can find our way out again if we have to. Felt like a spot of fresh air. Look, Tom, we, we've got to trust each other. 
It's for everyone's safety. Look at it that way. Including my son. Especially your son. I mean, that's what we agreed. Now, come on, Tom, come on. Let's have an early night, eh? We've got to get up first thing in the morning. Oh, Tom, you stop worrying, will you? He's all right. They're probably asleep by now. Sure you're all right? Yeah, I'm fine. You better hold my hand. Come on. Okay. Carefully. It's very slippery. Okay. Do you think we've come? I'm not sure. About half a mile, I should think. Oh, look, it just can't go on forever, surely. Look, we'll find a way out soon. Don't worry. Another hour or another day comes that doesn't matter. I couldn't stand another day. Yes, you could. Look, we both could. But nothing's going to happen to us except we'll just get a bit hungry, that's all. So we'll be all right if we keep our heads. Yes. Well, then, let's go back. No, no, Susan. Let's rest here for a while. No, let's keep going, please. No, no. Susan, we're both tired and it's late. We feel better after a few hours sleep. I couldn't sleep here! Yes, you could. Just, just lie down, please. Come on, Susan. Come on. Please, just lie down. Come on. Come on. Look, just make yourself as comfortable as you can. All right? There's just one more thing, Susan. I said that we could stay down here for a long time without coming to any harm. And we could. Several days. But we need some light. Look, it's half empty now. I daren't leave it on all night. Susan, it will be empty by the morning. As long as you don't go too far away. Well, there's nowhere much for me to go, is there?
Before we go, I'd like to make sure. I told you, Tom, they're perfectly safe. They are. The whole point of this early start is to get away before they're awake. It won't take long. All right. Have it your way. I should have put you on the first train home. You didn't drag me. I came along because I wanted to. Look, it's my fault that you're here. Come on. I'm here, and that's all there is to it. Saying things like that won't do any good. Look, you know I said there might be a way out of here. Well, well suppose there isn't. There will be. Well, there might not be, Susan. We spent hours wondering about last night, and in the end, well... The best thing we can do is to go back to the way we came in. But it's blocked up. We can wait there. If someone's reported us, they'll start looking for us. Who? Well, my father, perhaps. If he's seen the car, he'll wonder where I am. Perhaps. But he hasn't so far, has he? I better not go any further. I don't want to wake them. Here, have a look. My son keeps the campsite tidy. I'll say that for him. It's early yet. They're still sleeping. Like babies. Come on. Try again. There are lots of tunnels we haven't tried yet. There was one about 50 yards back, I remember. John, I don't know if I'm right, but we must be quite some way underground. So we must have been coming down without even noticing it. Now, if there is going to be a way out. It's not going to be down. So we have to try and keep going up all the time. Yes, you're right. And I thought of something else. What? Well, perhaps there is only one entrance. But don't a lot of caves have poles and chimneys or something? Well, perhaps we ought to keep as near to the surface as we can and... And then start looking for a hole in the roof. Do you think I'm right? Well, come on. Let's try anyway. Okay. Come on, 
the map, please, Tom. I thought so. Gonna have to buy some more maps. Why? I had a phone call last night. We have a, an appointment arranged. But it's been delayed for 24 hours. So we're gonna have to kill a day on the road. Tell me where you wanna go. I'll get you there. You just stick to driving. I'll do the map reading. All right? Well, let's get on. There's no hurry. My son and that girl will be awake by now. They could be on the road. If they pass this way, they'll see us. What does it matter if they do? Not his way. I warned you about that. It doesn't have to be his way. Anyway, it would attract too much attention. All we want to do is to leave them behind, safe and sound, that's all. You worry too much, Tom. surface after all. We must be. We followed the marks back to where we started. Oh, come on, John, let's try another tunnel. All right. Fill her up, please. Yeah. Oh, and, uh, check the front end, will you? And the, uh, the top. <sighs> no need to stop yet. Relax, Tom. They've got all the time in the world now. Well, what do you think? I don't know. I don't think I can get up there. I'll give it a try. Get up to the surface. 
I can't get up on my own. Go and find someone. Get help. You understand? Yeah. Susan? Yes? Be as quick as you can. All right. What's wrong with the motorway? I don't like motorways. It would be quicker. Oh, yes. We'd miss all this lovely scenery, wouldn't we? <laughs> A meeting. With whom? Look, Tom, we've all got our bit to do. Driving, that's your job. Stick to it. I just want to know my boy's all right, that's all. He is. Of course, if he's lost us, he could be home now. I'll phone him tomorrow. Look, he's with the girl, isn't he? I mean, he might take her home first. You don't know anything about her. You don't know where she lives, who she is. Well, what are you so bothered about? I mean, you know they're all right. You've seen for yourself. <laughs> 